Keys. We're in beautiful Colorado, just outside of Denver. Stevie and I found a little secluded place to do a little yoga, so let's get on with it. Uh, how about you meet me in a high plank? <sighs> Cultivating one long energy, one long line of energy from the heels out through the crown of the head. Breathing here. Hug the belly to the spine and lift the hips up to the high to the sky. Your body will resemble the capital letter A here. Let's start breathing. Inhale and exhale. Inch forward into a high plank, and then lower, low plank. Inhale, push up, exhale, lower. We're gonna do three more of these. Okay, exhale, downward facing dog. Take a few more rounds of cleansing breath here, breathe. On your next inhale, look forward and come forward into high plank. Inhale, lower, exhale, push up. Meet me in high plank, downward facing dog. Inhale, exhale. Take a deep breath in here. And let it go. Inhale, exhale, inhale, look forward. Let's do one more round of push-ups here. Inhale, lower you, exhale, push up. Meet me in high plank, push up into downward facing dog and breathe. Inhale, and exhale, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, travel forward to the top of your mat. You could take several steps, one step, hop, depending on how you feel today. We're going to take our fold at a wide leg stance, grabbing opposite elbows and a frag doll. You can bend your knees as much as you like here. Just remember to let the head and the neck hang heavy and let gravity take all of that tension you may have built up. Just run it down off the top of your head. Hugging the belly to the spine, breathe in. And exhale. Hang out here for a minute. Heel the feet together to a forward fold. Work on straightening the legs here. Head and neck are still heavy. Inhale, exhale. On your next inhale, press into something to create a long line of energy in a flat back from the tailbone out through the crown of your head. I push into my shins. You could use the mat, the floor, the ground, a block, whatever serves you best. Inhale here, hugging the belly to the spine and pulling the shoulder blades down the back. Breathe. Forward fold, slide the hands down to the mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. On the next inhale, we're going to root down through the feet. Reach up toward the sky. Stacking one vertebrae on top of one another. Breathing here. Shoulder blades slide down the back. Fingertips are energetic overhead. Belly hugging to the spine. Breathe here. Bring it out. Distance apart in this pose. 
Inhale, hugging all of the muscles to the bones in your body, specifically in the thighs and the biceps. Inhale, exhale, baby back bend, cactus the arms. To work the back bend into the upper back, you can rotate the elbows up towards the sky a little bit. Inhale, and stay for the exhale. Inhale, reach it high, mountain pose. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, our first chaturanga. You're going to plant your hands on either side of your feet. Hands are hip-width distance. You've been right here in high plank. We're going to go to low plank. Then we're going to pull it forward into upward-facing dog. The shoulder blades are sliding down the back. Chest pulls forward. Gaze is forward or up, depending on what feels good to you. I flipped onto the tops of my feet, and I'm pressing down fiercely. So much that my knees have come off the mat. Inhale. Exhale. Flip the feet over. Lift the hips high into downward facing dog. Breathe here. Call your dog if you're in the wilderness and you need to. Stevie Jean, come here, baby girl. Take a deep breath in and let it out. Breathe in. Look forward. Exhale. Travel forward to the top of your mat. Pet your dog because she's a good girl and she came back to her mama. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, mountain pose, root to rise. Exhale, back bend. Ah. Oh. Inhale, rise. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, chaturanga. High to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, travel forward. Halfway lift and fold. We're down and through the feet to rise up through the fingertips. Inhale. Exhale, back bend. Rise back up and fold it forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, chaturanga. High to low. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take a round of breath here. Inhale. And exhale. On your next inhale, look forward. Travel forward to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, thunderbolt pose. Sinking the hips low and lifting the arms up to the sky along with your chest. Shoulder blades sliding down the back. Breathe here. Exhale, sink a little bit lower. You can leave your arms expressed as you see here above. Or you can press them at heart center fiercely below. Inhale, and exhale. Inhale, exhale. Exhale. On your next exhale, forward fold, yeah. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, chaturanga, high to low. Inhale up, exhale downward facing dog. Inhale, right leg lift it high. In this leg high pose, pull the toes towards your face, which essentially will square off your hip to the mat. Belly hugs to the spine, and you're pressing evenly through the hands, which are shoulder width distance apart. Breathe in. Exhale, step it through, low lunge. Bringing the feet in between the hands. Pulling the shoulder blades down the back. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, stand it up. Crescent lunge. Think of mountain pose here in the upper body and a strong determined lunge in your lower body. Breathe here. I like to pop up to the ball of my foot, the back, and flex that, that left butt cheek 
to essentially give me better stability in this pose. Breathe here. Inhale, exhale, chaturanga. High to low. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg lifts. Take a moment here to press evenly through the hands and square off the hip by flexing the toes toward the face. Breathe in. Exhale, stiff it through, low lunge. Foot plants between the hands. Shoulder blades slide down the back. Strong in that back leg. Knees stacking over ankle in the lunge in the front. Belly hugs the spine. Look forward, chest forward. Exhale, crescent lunge. Make whatever little tweaks you made on the other side that made that post successful. Breathe. Exhale, chaturanga. High to low. Inhale, up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, travel forward to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, thunderbolt pose. Breathe here. Inhale and sink a little bit deeper. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Right foot, lift it high. Step it through, low lunge. Lift it high, crescent. Chaturanga. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. Left leg lifts high. Step it through, low lunge. Inhale, crescent. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, travel forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, thunderbolt pose. Hold it here. I wonder if you can hear the thunder rolling. Pose. A little deeper wherever you are. Breathe in. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, right leg lift high. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, warrior two. Whoa, mountain yoga. So let's stack this pose. Front knee stacking over front ankle. Back knife edge foot, parallel with the mat. Shoulders stacking over hips, arms reaching away from each other actively. Fingertips are energetic. Breathe here. Oh, let it out. Your gaze can be over the middle finger of your front hand. Breathe here. Let it out. Pull the shoulder blades down the spine here. Breathe in. You can work around with uh, your center of gravity here, whether or not you need to lean a little more forward or backward to feel stable in this pose. Do what you need to do. Breathe. Take a big inhale, and on your next inhale, reach forward, extended side angle. You're pushing with this front elbow into the front thigh. 
in order to open up through the chest and extend that top hand up, up, up to the sky. We're not taking a break here and leaning into this leg. Active through both hands and keep the warrior two in the lunge. Inhale and let it out here. Pull the shoulder blades onto the back, breathe here. Exhale, reverse warrior. Paint the sky with the top, with the front fingertips, keeping the lunge. Breathing here. Inhale, stay for the exhale. Inhale, exhale, chaturanga. We've been here before. Take this low. Inhale, left leg lifts high. Exhale, step it through. Low lunge. Inhale, spin it open. Warrior two. Like we did on the other side. Nice edge of the foot parallel with the back of your mat. Front knee stacking over front ankle. Arms extending away actively from each other. Shoulders stacking over hips. Gazes down the front middle finger. Inhale and exhale. Breathe here. Stay committed to your lunge. Inhale, extend forward, and then twist into extended side angle. Breathe your back arm up to the sky, and that top elbow, front elbow, pressing into the front thigh. Active through the fingertips. Keep that warrior two lunge. Breathe here. Pulling the shoulder blades down, down the back. Inhale. Exhale, reverse. Paint the sky with the fingertips. You can let the back arm rest or do a little half bind. I like to call it the old man. You know, old men grab the back of their pants when they're making a decision at the Costco. So that they go, inhale, exhale, chaturanga. Hide a low push up. Inhale up, exhale, downward facing dog. All right, you guys, do you want to flow that one with me? Inhale, right leg lifts high. Exhale, step through, low lunge. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, extended thigh. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, chaturanga. Up and down. Inhale, left leg. Low lunge. Warrior two. Extended. Reverse. Shut around you. Up and down. Right leg. Step through. Warrior two. Extended and reverse. Breathing. Inhale up. Exhale downward facing dog. Left leg. Low lunge. Warrior two. Extended side. Reverse. Chaturanga. One more time through, guys. Low lunge. Warrior two. Extended. Reverse. Chaturanga. Left leg. Inhale up. Exhale. <clears throat> Downward facing dog. Breathe here. Reset.
take a deep breath in and exhale it out. Breathe in. Ah, let it go. Breathe here. Look forward. Travel forward to the top of your mat. Stand up in the mountain. Bring the hands to heart center. I'll take you guys through crow pose. It's a fun little playful pose that has many steps to integration into the full expression. So whatever you can do is congratulatory because this one's a difficult pose. So start with me at the top of your mat. I like to give myself a little bit of space. If I'm in a studio and I have a wood floor, I'll go a little bit off the top of my mat. But since there's some ground right there that I don't want to run into, I'm going to step off a little bit. So let's go mountain, forward fold, halfway lift, crow. Plant your hands and make a shelf, 90 degree angles with your elbows. Then you're going to plant your knees as close to your elbows or your armpits as you can to get your ass up over your head. You're going to play around with lifting one foot, then the other, then both. Breathe in. Shoot it back. Up dog. And down. Take a moment to play around with that pose on your own time and see how much you can develop your curl. When you're ready, go ahead and meet me in downward facing dog. Breathe it here. Inhale and exhale. Breathe in and give it back. Inhale, right leg lifts high. Exhale, step it through, low lunge. Inhale, crescent lunge, we've been here. Exhale, hands to heart center here. Breathe here, press fiercely. Open up the heart by pulling the shoulder blades down the chest. Inhale, lean forward and exhale, twist to the right. Revolved crescent here. Think of stacking elbow, wrist, elbow. Pressing fiercely at your palms. Strong lunge, like we've been practicing this whole time. You can continue the twist by looking up or down or straight out to the side. Whatever feels best for you. Hug the belly to the side, inhale, exhale, unwind. Inhale, exhale, warrior two, spin it open. Set it up, strong pose. Inhale and exhale. Breathe here. Inhale, straighten the front leg. Exhale, tick tock the arms to six and 12. That bottom arm, press into something, whether it be a yoga block, the ground, I prefer my shin. That way you can open up your chest by pressing in actively. You can spin the shoulder blades down the back and open that top arm a little further back. Breathe here. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, that back arm's gonna lift you up into star. Parallel both feet to the sides of the mat. Look up and celebrate this pose. Inhale, exhale, back bend. Inhale, star. Exhale, horse pose. Turn the feet outward. Heels in. Knees track in the direction of your toes. Drop the hips low. Breathe here. <sighs> Hands pressing fiercely at heart center. Focus on the breath. Inhale. And exhale. Breathe here. If you want to join me, I'll do a round of Kriyas. Inhale, hands up high. Exhale, ha! Inhale, ha! 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 Five! Four! Three! Two! One! Star pose. Warrior two to the front. 
afterwards. Chaturanga. Inhale up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, left leg high. Exhale, step it through, low lunge. Inhale, crescent. Exhale, bringing the hands to heart center. Strong in that low lunge. Inhale, lean forward. Exhale, twist to the left. Pressing fiercely in through the palm. Stacking elbow, wrist, wrist, elbow. Hugging belly to the spine. Either looking straight out at the side, as I choose to do, or up or down. Breathe here. Inhale. Exhale and one. Crescent. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Spin it open. Warrior two. Take a moment to strength, strengthen your base in this pose. Knee stacking over ankle, back leg strong, arms extending away from each other strongly. Breathe here. Inhale, exhale, straighten that front leg. Tick tock the arms, just look some 12. Triangle pose. Sliding the shoulder blades down the chest, pressing into something with that bottom hand. Breathe here. Oh, and exhale it out. Inhale. Exhale. On your next inhale, that back arm is going to lift you up high in the sky. Pivot both feet parallel to the sides of your mat. Inhale. Exhale. Baby back bend. Inhale. Star. Exhale. Horse. We were here. Make the same adjustments you made on the other side. Inhale. Exhale. Breathe it here. We'll do another set of Kriyas on this side if you want to join me. Inhale, arms high. Exhale. Yeah. Yeah. Chaturanga. Hot dog. Downward facing dog. Breathe here. Inhaling and exhaling. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, travel forward to the top of your mat. Woo, on a slant here. Woo. Meet me in mountain pose here. Straight and strong. Pull the uh, hands down to heart center. We'll work on tree. Grounding down through the left foot. Bring up the right foot into tree. You can have it as a kickstand. Your toe up on the ground and then place on your ankle. Foot on your calf or foot all the way up into your thigh. Really, it's your preference. Inhale, express your tree. <sighs> Inhale, reach high. Exhale, sit the foot down. Bring the hands back to prayer. Inhale, ground down through the right leg. Lift your left leg into tree. Inhale and exhale. Grounding down strong through that standing leg. When you're ready, express your tree. Inhaling and exhaling. Breathing here. Inhale. 
Inhale, reach it high. Exhale, hands to heart, center. Good job. <sighs> Inhale, reach high. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, chaturanga. Look at what the dog did. Up dog and downward facing dog. On your next inhale, meet me on your back. We're done with our standing practice for the afternoon. Say hi to your pooch. What you find in there, baby? And oh boy, doesn't that feel good laying down in the forest? We'll go through a little bit of bridge here. Breathing in, bringing your feet close to your buttocks and your hands are reaching down towards your feet, laying at either side of, of your heels. Inhale, pull the belly to the spine. Exhale, lift the hips high to the sky. You'll probably notice your shoulder blades will automatically slide down your back when you get up into this pose, allowing some space between your, like in your neck, between your ears and your shoulder blades. It feels really good here. Mindful not to look around in this pose, just keep your gaze up to the sky. Breathe here. Exhale, release. <sighs> Windshield wipe for the legs. <sighs> That's nice. When you're ready, we'll go for round two. Breathe in. Exhale, lift the hips high. Breathing in. Inhale in and exhale. Ah, bring it back down. Windshield wiper the legs if you must. Feels really great. Inhale, give yourself a hug. And exhale, your right knee down to the ground, placing your left leg up over. You might feel that hip stretch there. If not, Pulling that knee up off the ground and breathe. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, release. Exhale, switch it out, other side. Breathing here, inhale, exhale, release. <laughs> Stevie chickens, we're gonna lay in Shavasana in the mud. With that said, pull the knees to the south, give yourself a final hug and then reach it out for our final Shavasana. Inhale and exhale. <laughs> As you can see, my baby girl's not making it very easy for a Shavasana and for beginning to be rained on in the Colorado mountains. I want to thank you so much for joining us today for our outdoor yoga experience. Namaste.